I greet you in Jesus' precious name. It is the 31st of May, the last day of the month, Friday morning, 2024. And this is your friend, Angus Buchan, with a thought for the day. We go straight to the book of Psalms, and I'm reading Psalm 39 and verse 3. My heart was hot within me while I was musing, the fire burned. Musing means contemplating. It means thinking deeply. It means being in a quiet place. You know that lovely old preacher by the name of George Matheson? You hear me often speak about him, the blind preacher. You know, they loved him so much that when he died and they buried him, and they put the coffin in the grave. They say they filled that grave with red roses. He was a wonderful man of God. George Matheson says we must come apart and we must sit quietly and allow the fire of God to fill our hearts before we go out and speak to others. He says, oh, my soul, would you have your life glorified? beautified, transfigured to the eyes of men, get up into the secret place of God's pavilion where the fires of love are burning. Your life shall shine gloriously to the dwellers on the plain. Your prayers shall be luminous. They shall light your face like the face of Moses when he knew not that it shone. Your words shall be burning. They will kindle many a heart journeying on the road to Emmaus. Your path shall be radiant when you have prayed in Elijah's solitude. You shall have Elijah's chariot of fire. We need to really allow the Holy Spirit to speak to us, get alongside the Lord, sit by that little fireplace and look into those beautiful bright coals and flames and let the Holy Spirit speak to you. Then go into all the world and tell people about your beloved Jesus and you will get amazing results because you see, they won't see you. No, they'll see Christ in you. Have a wonderful day. Jesus bless you and goodbye.